Hi, so I got more, uh, what do you call them, bottle cups. I always forget. Uh, here, we got seven. This reading is going to be about how do he or she look like the one that you're going to marry so you don't get confused. I want to be sp as specific as possible. So I put like a lot of here bottle cups so you can choose one. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So I choose, I'm going to drink my coffee. Got Spanish latte and rose latte today. Let's start with number one here. Number one. Number one, how does he or she look like? Number one, this one is old. This person is kind of old. I feel like uh, mid 50 for some of you, it's a general reading. Some of you could be like that uh, if you're like in this age range. It could be like that. I'm seeing someone half bald, but not that bald. Like, you know, like got some gaps in, in the head, like from uh, the middle. Or it could be also, this one is Asian. And also I'm seeing someone who's like Korean, Filipino or something like that. Um, uh, like an Asian descent. Also, they got a uh, black something, a black car. This person is a widow for some of you. Some of you could be a widow or someone passed away like uh, their husband or wife. Uh, what do you call a widow man? Can you call a man a widow? And also, this person got a black cat and a black something. What do you call it? Tornado? Torna what a tornado? Tor not tornado, no. What do you call that? Got a... Uh, there's caskets around this person. There's something black and caskets. Like, uh, this person could be work working in... Uh, you know what you call that? Like, work in the cemetery or something like that. Or, like, uh, in arranging, arranging things for, like, people who passed away or stuff like that. Also, for some of you, I'm seeing this person got is like brownish white skin color, and this person could be like uh, not willing to change something about themselves. You know, this person uh, like because they don't want to change something about themselves. They also got a sense of uh, integrity when it comes to their finance, and they like to live like a simple life. I feel like they like even if they got money or not, they like to be simple. Let me drink my coffee. This person likes to be simple a lot. So I feel also this person... Uh, I just like got quiet. I feel like for some of you, this person is watching you and not sure if they can reply or write something on your page. I feel like this person is talking to you for some of you. Also, this person got, like, I feel sometimes could be, like, really annoying because they like to live simple and, uh, like, too much to the extreme. You know those people, like, some people that like it this way, but then they go ahead and judge other people for, like, spending money on shoes or whatever. They got money, but they like to be, like, simple but doing it too much. You know those kind of people? I don't know if you're this kind of person, but sometimes I like to spend my money. But, and then, you know, that's like, this is the kind of person who, like, will judge you. Like, why are you, uh, like, spending that money on a shoe? You need you only need a shoe, like, to wear it, to go outside, you know? I was like, I need the shoe because it, it, look, it got sparkle on it. And, like, I need it. I know that I need it. Okay? And it's just there, and I don't wear it anymore. But, and I never, I never did. <clears throat> but I felt like I needed it. You know? I don't know, I feel also this person could be like the total opposite from you and they got something about bandana. They keep wearing bandanas. Also, this person could be not bald, but they got a big forehead for some of you. I'm going to drink my coffee. Big forehead, a little bit older than you. They got a, uh, a burned skin from tan or something like that for some of you. Their, uh, their eyes could be brownish, brownish hazel or something like that. I'm seeing also a gray something. They got a gray hair all over them. I'm not sure. This person, like, no, I'm not trying to be rude, but this person, like, life around him, what's well, around him is kind of basic. Like, I'm trying to see something, but, he, like, he or she lives, like, in a basic place. Like, they don't like to spend money on shit. So it's like, they got nothing. They got basic. They, everything is basic around them. They got nothing. They, I swear, they got nothing. Like, it's the kind of person maybe who does not like to spend money on a lot of things. They wear, like, one shirt, two shirts, stuff like that. They they do have money, per se, but they don't like to spend it. It's like that. They got, like, 
I I want to try see what's around them what they have but they like to live like a simple life because they feel like maybe this is a death it's like they think that people are gonna die anyway we're gonna die we're not gonna take our clothes our money with us or stuff like that this is the kind of person number two who are you gonna marry this person got ooh, this person's sexy sexy as fuck they got a cat eye their eyes is like kind of sexy when you look at their eyes they got this sharp eye look and eyebrows they sharp and beautiful their eyes is kind of beautiful like you can just easily get lost in in their eyes but get scared for some reason like when they look at you get scared because they have this sharp look they look at you and then you're dead something about it like this also this person got something pink or a bit. If she's a girl, I'm not sure why I heard that, but she got a pinkish pussy. Like, you're like a pussy because it's pink. Something about her pussy is pink. You're like a pussy, pink pussy. I'm not sure why. Mm, why you like pink pussy? But something about it. It's like pink pussy. I'm not sure what is it. Like, there's a pink pussy there. Uh, also, her lips. You like her lips or you like his lips. And uh, I feel like... Um, also, it could be a man or a woman. For some of you, I feel like uh, this person got a really frizzy hair or a big afro hair or a curly hair. and Or like for some of you, they got she got wavy hair, like a straight, uh, she color it straight and kind of gray blonde hair, something like that, gray blonde hair or like it's a general reading. I'm seeing like this uh, this person got a lot a lot of uh, uh, kicks, a lot of sneakers. They wear a lot of Jordan, or she got a lot of heels. They got a lot of clothes. This person got a lot of clothes. It's the opposite from the bottom one. Number one. This person got a lot of shit around them. They got clothes. They got shit they don't wear. They buy shit they don't like. They like it, but then they don't like it, but they keep it in case. They go buy things. This person spend their money on shit. This person buy a lot of things. This person like like to look glamorous and fancy. This person like fresh, fresh clean shoes. They like fresh clean shoes. I feel like this person like to clean their shoes, but maybe for some of you they don't know how to do it or they do it, try it. And also I see this person could start their let. I feel uh, their name. The letters in their name is A Q O S T D uh, P and H and A and M. And also, I feel like this person got uh, something I see this person standing, and there's like night stars around this person. Like, you know how to see the galaxy and the universe, like stars. Like, this person's face, just you look at their eyes, and then you get lost, and you look, you kind of stare at their eyes, and you can see the universe, something like that. Or it's kind of weird. I see this person standing, there's the stars at night around them. Like, this person likes to look at the stars at night a lot. Uh, this person could, uh, could have, like, a really black eyes or something black, like, dark eye color. Or some of you I see or dark brown. This person has dark blonde, d- dark blonde hair. They got dark blonde hair or something. But their eyes is kind of brown and black. There's no... Uh, or for some of you, just one or two got blue eyes. But the, the most case for this number two is black and uh, brown. Also, they wear a lot of yellow colors or a lot of colors. They wear a lot of blue colors. They got a lot of blue around them. I'm not sure why. This person is also... I'm not sure you feel like for now you feel like this person is toxic. Uh, you feel like this person is uh, toxic. You don't want to be around them because you feel like they're going to, the, your self-esteem is damaged or something or their self-esteem. I feel like your self-esteem is damaged to approach them or something like that. I'm going to ring my coffee. You feel like this person is giving you the, their back and not want to talk to you. This person is not that tall. It's like medium average size. Or like a bit shorter or short and uh, I feel like um, this person likes perfume a lot they smell like perfume they smell like a lot of perfume smell like a lot of perfume and also let me see what I can see they got like a long nose like they got long nose sharp nose or something like that I feel like they got Nose is like uh, something about their nose. Also, their feature. This person is interesting because the way you see this person, I feel like you see this person is kind of similar to you. 
and you feel like this person is similar but there is a sense of you want to throw up and you feel disgusting and depressed and you want to sink to the floor i'm not sure why so number three uh how this person look like this person is straight blonde blue eyes gray eyes this person is like really white this person is white as as what as this chocolate the white chocolate this person is white like cheese this person is really white i'm telling you this person is white it's i have to say it spirit was like say it say it this person is white yeah, like really really white i've seen an al i call it albano 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 white also could be an albano for some of you uh could be that also i feel like this person got a quite an attitude this person got an attitude they're feisty they choke like i feel like this person choking when they're angry they choke and they get so angry sometimes they faint like this person i'm not sure why it's like you know it's like you're gonna get a like a heart attack or like we call it yeah you got you're like you, you got seizure seizure what the fuck is that also, this person likes to cut people off. This person cut, cut people off all the time. This person is cutting people. Also, this person could be like uh, mixed or something. This person likes to ignore people a lot. This person like choke a lot when, whenever they want to speak. They cannot speak. They just get angry and they faint into the room. They faint into the nothingness. I'm not sure what is that. They just go into the nothingness and they just faint. They go and they wanna. They don't wanna deal with anything, and they see nothing around them, and they just get in, in into bed, or just sit on the sofa, and they see nothing, think of nothing. Their brain sometimes freeze, like freeze and stop. There's no thought. They see nothing when they're depressed. They just look at the table, and they just like really scary because they look at something, and they just like look at the wall or look at the floor, and they see nothing, or they think of nothing. They just space out. I feel like this person is kind of going through like a depression time right now and uh they are really stressed their brain is overloaded it's not it's not nice uh oh they could be just whiter than you and not that white but whiter than you and you see them as really white because i know my ex was uh really really black like one of my exes was like that color black a little bit uh, lighter than that and he saw me as really white but i was like i'm not white just stop calling me white um brown i just needed to say that yeah so maybe this person is brown and you see them as white also this person could be an ex of yours or you know their ex or something like that this person also does not want to talk to you right now for some reason also, this person got uh, a hangover right now. This person is really hangover. Also, this person could be like, it could be the black one and you could be lighter than them. This person is dark. This person having a hangover. For some of you, I see the white, white, white. And for others of you, I see this situation where you're white and this person think you're white and this other person think they're the black. Like there's, there's a different color. And this person see it as extreme different and uh or you see it like that and this person got like they drink a lot they gotta have a hangover right now they try to eat pussy if he's a man and he cannot eat pussy oh she's tried to suck dicks and they cannot do it i feel like they cannot do it anymore they cannot do that all they wanna they wanna do is just go back to the memory inside their head and masturbate alone like why do i want to masturbate alone thinking about her or him not want to fuck a real person in front of me like this person is like then they go into the nothingness and then when they're angry they go into the nothingness i feel like there could be a tourist or another time when they're angry they get so angry they faint and then they look at nothing and the brain gets so stressed out oh my god you have no idea this person exploded inside them but they look calm from the outside suppose it could be black as i said or like they really about their lips you like their lips uh, but there are some uh, like um uh, color different between you two and uh, the letter is start with s o b uh, q uh, t and uh, r 
This person can be like brownish also, but you're like lighter than them. I'm not sure why this person think that. Someone think this person think that there's a different color, and I feel like it's annoying because you think there's like not extreme different or something like that. But this person will like oh, no 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 no. Then I'm not sure what is it. Like you're dead and I'm dead. It's like you don't see it. Like what is it? I don't see that. I don't see the different. But something about it. This person think there's a different, and. Uh, I feel like they think that you're not going to belong in their culture or you're not going to belong. I'm not, what culture is that? Like, I feel it's annoying. Like, I feel like you're going to be annoyed because you could be, like, from the same country or same land. It's like, you're not going to belong with my family because we're different color. Like, seriously, you eat the same food. We go to the same restaurant. We go to the same groceries. We go to the same hospitals. We do the same thing. We go to the same school. Like, what different it is? Like, because of your insecurities, you don't feel like you're going to be so angry. It's like, because of your own insecurities, like, because I'm going to walk around with you and we look different. And then you think that we will be different because I see you different because of your own shit. Like, this person is annoying. Uh, number three, number three, and this person does not know how to read. I'm not sure what, not know how to read. This person does not read signs. They don't look at signs. They don't try to think. They don't try to listen to themselves. This person's ego is calm to the extreme. They don't listen to their intuition. Number four, how this person look like? This person kind of, oh, this person got a wave about them. When they speak, they speak like that. You ever been like in a in a class where someone read read a book and it was just like same same level of reading, like you wanna sleep, but their voice is kind of sexy to you. Cause you feel like they whisper in your ears like that and make you feel like, uh, I don't know why I feel dizzy or something like that but their voice make you feel like you want to faint or something for others of you this person is like uh, speaking like they speak another language also than you and uh, they could be foreign from you this person got a really beautiful beautiful voice you love this person's voice because they make you feel like intense i'm not sure why the voice makes you feel intense when they speak because you feel horny or you feel something or you feel lost you feel dizzy like just when the sun hits you so hard and you feel like you want to faint to the floor and the sun just keep hitting you and hitting you and hitting you we used to play that when we were a kid when we were kids because here is just really hot and i don't know why we played this game but we just sit in the sun till we like almost want to faint and we don't wear shoes and the floor is really hot and we're just gonna die and then we go inside the house like fainting. Not sure why. We do some stupid shit. I feel like yeah, we might for some of you might know this person uh, was a childhood friend or something. Or since you were kids. This person got a, this person got a goofy smile. I need to drink my coffee. The person got a goofy smile about them, something about them. They're goofy. And uh, there's something about this person, like, I feel calm. This person is really calm, and they're thinking about something now. I feel like right now while I'm doing this reading, they're thinking about something. Whenever you watch this, they will be still thinking about it. Not, whenever you watch this, you'll be thinking about it. You'll be thinking it's a general reading. Thinking about giving you something. They want to come to you and give you something. I feel like a promise. They want to give you a promise. They they want to promise you that they wouldn't do something that they did before. This person want to come to you and promise you something. This person kind of got a rosy cheeks or something for some of you. And uh, uh, their eyes is kind of small. And uh, they got a... Something about them, they got a scar on their forehead. I'm touching my forehead or something like that. Their hair is kind of... Uh, messed up a little bit or they do something with their hair uh, their hair got a also what is it seriously I feel like this person is fainting right now I'm not sure what is that you know like when you cannot get out of bed because you just feel so depressed and you're 
your level of hormones or something in your head is like the depression that you're trying to fight it that you're trying to fight depression and get out of bed every day this is like the situation that's going on with this person and when they listen to your voice and they just get lost and lost and they don't know how to pick themselves up or hold the phone or answer you or do anything i feel like that this person is like uh, really sad so we're saying just leave them leave them until they figure things out also, this person got, I feel like, um, yeah, I cannot breathe. Like, this person's really depressed. Like, if you know someone that depressed or feel like uh, they've been ignoring you and you didn't know why, this person is like that. It's really depressed, like their head and everything. This person do want to communicate something to you. Like, um, they will come fast because they feel they took their sweet ass time and... They feel like uh, you got someone else. They feel like there's other three men around you that they like you. Or they know that those three men or women that they like you. If you're a woman, this person likes your nail. Or if you're a man, this person likes your nail. Mm. This person really needs you, I'm hearing. It's like, I really need you. I really, 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 really need you. I need you now. Something like that. And this person looks at the floor. I swear, it's like, you know, see, I'm so hypnotized by it. It's like, look at the floor. I look at something and they feel dizzy and they feel like they need you and they don't know what to do. And they then they go lay down again. Well, this energy. Got number five. Uh, number five, so how does your person look like? This person jumps a lot. This person jumps a lot like a rabbit. This person jumps everywhere. This person like jumping everywhere, jumping everywhere. They could be like, this person could have like a sharp, uh, like a uh, ear. They look like a rabbit ear or something like that. I'm not sure what about their ears. They, they have like a tiny nose. Like, I don't know, they doesn't look cute like a fairy. This kind of cute person. This person's face is kind of cute. <laughs> this person is so attractive. This person is so attractive. They like to jump a lot. This person jumping everywhere. They jump. They jump everywhere. They dance. Or they do things. Or I'm not sure. This person is active. I see this person go moving everywhere. It's like, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. This person going circles. I'm like, hold on in my head. Where is this person going? This person just jumping here. You right and forth and right and forth everywhere. They jump everywhere. This person is really active. This person got cute a smile. They smile in their nose or something about it when they get angry. This person is like really, really cute. This person is very, very beautiful. Very beautiful. And they're like beautiful. Oh, my God. You know someone like that you're going to marry? So I feel like this person, uh, something about them, they either got a green eyes or... They got a uh, brown eyes or something black eyes, and uh, you love their. They got a lot of beauty marks. What do you call those uh, tiny th black dots? This black one. Uh, call them. They got those a lot uh, on their head or on the face or something like that. Or they got them and you like them. They got those things. And this person, like, also, this person, like, really fun. I'm, like, their energy is really fun. They got a lot of fun things around them. It's like, this person do a lot of fun things. They're kind of crazy alone. They do a lot of fun things. See, this person is really creative, jumping around. There's a lot of color. There's a lot of things. They do a lot of things. This person is very creative. And they got a sense of humor. And also, they got something about, uh, a, they, they can't smell bullshit, I'm not sure what is it, I feel like you had a fight with this person several times, so you're gonna marry this person, also this person got a, uh, something about, uh, what is that, yeah, it's like they're mixed, I see also Indian here, cause I was like touching here, the side of my nose, you know, like where you put this tiny gold thing, oh, they got like a, a piercing on their nose or they could be mixed or something like that also this person is uh, I feel like you this person is kind of mysterious to you because you don't know a lot about this person that much for some of you it's a general reading and also this person let me get you more this person reads a lot or they're very very intelligent I'm here like that let me doing my coffee this person is very intelligent. 
letters they start with uh, um, or any like the letters in their name is O uh, T is um, N it's Q and uh, it's another Q and a letter uh, 5 and I'm not sure why uh, letter 5 number 5 what 5 wait one five months from now something about it gonna happen so yeah where did we read number six so number or oh, is that number six yeah number six so number six how your person look like this person is kind of a bit fat or choppy my hair fall down this person fat and chubby and they're hairy for some of you it could be that or they could be just thick and they're hairy. I'm not sure why I heard that. Some of you, please, man. She's a woman. She got a lot of hair on her face, or I'm not sure on her face. Maybe she got thick eyebrows, or like a lot of hair on her head. And uh, what else? This person sometimes smells bad. I gotta be honest with you. I'm not sure why I saw that, but they smell bad sometimes. It's kind of stinky sometimes. I'm not sure why they're stinky. Maybe they got a lot of shit around them and they work in some stinky place. That's why they smell stinky sometimes. The person is stinky. They're a very stinky person. Tell them to shower. They don't take care of their hygiene a lot, so just tell them to eat healthy and take care of their hygiene. They're stinky. It's fat and stinky a little bit. Swear, just you gonna love them. You gonna love them. Swear, saying, cause they're cute and they do a lot of things and they're fun. But sometimes they're stinky, maybe because of their the atmosphere around them, or they just go walk around, or they do something and they come back from the jogging or something like that, and they smell really bad. So tell them to shower after that, cause you are not gonna deal with this smell. And uh, what else I'm seeing here? This person got a tattoo on their forehead or on their eyes. Oh, they got tattooed somewhere. What? Got a thug tear tattoo. Or there's something like that. This person is kind of big. Maybe it's like a big man. A big, really big man that look really huge. And they got, and he got a thug tear. Like, you know, that tear. Thug. And it smells stinky. Because sometimes he works in somewhere. And he go work somewhere outside. Or they go outside and hang or something. Come and stinky. Something about it. This person, for some of you, was in jail. Some of you, that it's a general reading. If she's a woman, she got a butterfly tattoo on her ass. I'm not sure why I'm seeing that. This person kind of stinky. I'm a spirit keeps saying that. Spirit, why? We got it. They got a stinkiness. They got the stinkiness. Oh my god, it smells like cheese. This person, why are they stinky? Spirit, they're saying because they. They don't like to clean. She said, this person don't sugarcoat it for them. Yeah, I'll always be real. They're stinky. For some of you, yeah, this person's stinky because they work outside. For others of you, this person's stinky because they don't like to shower a lot. They're stinky, but you're going to like him. Like him or her. Yeah. I feel like they used to be stinky because they, for the place they were, maybe they were in jail, so they still act like they're in jail. Not sure. But I feel like this person, let me see. I feel like you're going to love their personality a lot, this person. But you're going to love the muscle. It's like, you love, what do you love this person? <laughs> Spirit, I'm not meaning to be judgmental, but why do they love this person? Gotta, this person makes you laugh a lot because they're funny. This person funny jokes a lot and make your life really better because you were miserable or you were sad. And this person always come inside the house and make it, make it fun and make you feel happy and make you feel like uplifted. So you love this about this person that always come inside the house and make you feel feel happy. They make you feel away. They make you feel happy. You feel really happy. You're blessed to have this person around because their their personality also. I feel like this person jokes a lot, respect you a lot, and give you a lot of respect, and they're very gentle with you, and they're very loving and helpful. This person helps a lot around the house. This person is like, they're equal. They're equal with you. Like, they help a lot. Whatever you want, they help you. They're always there for you. They're, it's like they're always there for you. They're perfect. They help you a lot, and they just there. They're just there, always there. They will drop everything to come to you. So that's perfect, yeah. But they need to shower give them something 
So number seven, <laughs> number seven, <laughs> number seven. Oh my god, number seven. I got giggles all over me. Goosebumps. This is the ding dong, king kong. Uh oh. I think this one is. So this person is really sexy. This person got ooh. This person is hot. This person like you see this person and will fuck them all the time. We're gonna be a fuck, 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 fuck all the time. Your future husband or wife. So we're gonna fuck together all the time. This person like the color green or they smoke a lot of greens. This person is a psychic. Could be. I'm not sure where I heard that. Could be a psychic. This person is psychic. This person. Uh, got an attitude when it comes to life a different than it's like this person like i see a lot of people walking in a way and this person walks the other way this person go follow their own rhythm like this person really seriously follow their own rhythm spirit saying this person is like spirit love this person spirit saying we love this person we love this person like if spirit loves this person oh my god oh my god that's cute i'm not sure i feel cute feelings inside my heart this person is so cute and lovely. I love this person. Don't be jealous. I know it's your husband or wife. But they are really cute. This person is like really fun. They walk around and they just talk to spirit on their head or something like that. Maybe they're not aware that they do that. This person walks and they just look at people and they know what they think, what they feel. It's like this person like can... I feel like this person walks around and they can hear everything in their head. And so it goes like... Da, 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 they hear that, 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 they hear that. Feel, 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 everything. And also, I feel like this person is like really, really cute. What, what is the cuteness about them? They're very loving inside their heart. And they don't give a fuck. This person is the kind of person who... Like, always laugh about everything. Like, even if something bad happened to them, they will still be, like, laughing about it. Like, oh, why did this happen? It's fine. It's like this person got this attitude. I feel like what you're going to love about this person is, like, how they they blend in. I feel like this person blends in everything. Like, you can take this person anywhere, and they blend in in any society, any culture, any friend. They can blend with people easily, can connect with people, can connect with everyone, this person. But I feel they got triggered. Like, if they don't want to connect with someone, it's, like, so fucking hard to get. I feel like you try, like, you know, a locked door. Like, you try to open this door, and it's really locked. If they don't want to connect with someone, you will know it and everyone else around them will know that they don't want to connect with this person you will try to open their mouth make them talk to this person do that they wouldn't like this person like if they set their brain on something they would not do it they would like if they don't want to connect with someone they would not connect with this person so we want you to know that they don't like to be forced this person did not like to be forced and if you try to force them to change who they are or what they are they will just like they will just Spirit saying they will just show you something. I'm telling you, they will show you something. They will make you feel it. If they, if you're an equal partner and you try to force them to do something they don't like, and you try to change them, they will try to do the same thing to you, so you can feel the same pain. Before they, <coughs> if you fix it, fine. If you didn't, they will leave. Also, I feel like this person got a. Uh, <coughs> this person what? I feel like this person like walks a lot alone and talk a lot to themselves or listen to something. Well, they seriously talk to spirit. I've seen this this person talking, 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 and there's like behind them a lot of spirits walking, walking, walking around them, something like that. And this person will look at the skies or look at something and they talk, talk. I feel like this person been doing that since they were a kid. Like they would just talk and talk to spirit, and they talk and talk and talk and talk. And it's like, I feel like this person, like, when you walk around, it's just kind of intense, like, uh, I never felt this way, like, uh, for an intense spiritual thing. Like, this person walks in a room, and there's, like, spiritual people, and there's spirit and souls, and there's, like, people who are alive. And they're all together in the room, and this person can sense everyone in the room, like you and the spirit and the souls and everything around them. And this person is kind of, like, really pure. And let me see the letters. The letters is F and D, the letters in their name, and also A, uh, A, another A, I'm not sure I saw another A, and H, another A, Spirit Buddha, and a lot of A's, like that's kind of like four A's or something, and uh, a letter C, and Spirit Sun, whoa, I saw something here. Person, I'm just like this really sharp person. Like, like, 
Their spirit is really sharp. They can just sense everything in the dark. And they terrify bad spirit away also this person. You've been married to this person in, a, in one life before. There's something. What is that? It's like a trophy. Something like that. I feel like you're gonna love this their body also. Hope you like this reading.